Earlier, we caught up with the South Sioux City Cardinals, but now it's time to take a look at their Week 1 opponent and fellow Metro School, the Sioux City North Stars, who are loaded with veteran talent this year. The Stars come into the season with quite the experienced group, highlighted by 13 seniors and zero freshmen or sophomores on the roster. It was a successful year for North last season, finishing with a 6-5 and five record in 5A, which was their first winning season since 2010. By breaking the losing record streak, the program took a step in the right direction, and that is momentum Sioux City North hopes to carry from last year to now and have an even better season. Yeah, we'd love to make it two, two winning seasons in a row, and it's been a great building block for our team. Our numbers are through the roof, around 90 to 100 kids right now, um, and that's just, you know, you know, numbers equal wins, and wins equals numbers when it comes to teams. So we were six and three, and we had a couple. Our first few weeks were we had a lot of question marks still. You know, once we got to like week four or five, we kind of had things sorted out, figured out. We want to we want to start week one that way, um, start off rolling right away, and kind of just build off of that momentum. Looking at the roster, head coach Mitch Moore will have starting quarterback Carson Schrobin back under center. Senior totaled 1,100 yards and scored nine touchdowns for the Stars a season ago. Also, leading rusher Dayton Harrell returns for the team. But the question mark seems to be on the line for the squad, who lost three of its top four tacklers and nine total linemen from last year, all while not having a player on the roster who recorded a sack. But the Stars feel it's their developed players that can make an impact. Yeah, I would say so. We have a pretty young line, one senior lineman, and uh, I think our coach do, coaches do a really good job of just getting kids developed and knowing like what the kids are supposed to do. So that's that's a pretty big part. In uh, our line right now, just trying to build them up. Development. Uh, we have a great. I mean, our coaching staff's outstanding. I, I mean, our offensive line coach is great. Uh, it's developing them. We have a lot of capable bodies, strong kids. It's just getting them that experience and confidence to play in our varsity game. The Stars looking to continue the momentum from last season, opening up Week One in an All-Metro matchup, taking on the South Sioux City Cardinals tomorrow night.